Okay, you've got a beauty emergency, and it's due to the fact that you're having a walk of shame after a crazy night, right? That's what we're talking about right here. We're talking about Beauty 911, inspired by Walk of Shame, my new movie, out May 2nd. We're here at InStyle.com, where their beauty editors have some really great tips for survivors and stuff. Like, for instance, how to tame out all night hair when you don't have time to wash and style. This happens to me all the time. I'm a no-wash expert. I, of course, just use spit, but the beauty editors told me that, um, if a guy has baby powder in his bathroom, you can use that as dry shampoo. What? That is such a great idea. Flour also works weirdly. Otherwise, a top knot using a ponytail holder or even a rubber band if you're in a pinch is always an option. Great tip. Okay, next they talk about how to remove clumpy smeared mascara with no makeup remover. Well, first of all, you gotta opt for the uh, you know waterproof formula so this doesn't happen to you. But if you're not using the waterproof formula, um, it's too late for that. You know, you want a wet a Q-tip. Again, I just go with the, just right on your tongue and just, you know, work it out there. And um, if not, if you don't have a Q-tip, I mean, we don't all travel with those all the time. Then a rolled up wad of toilet paper works, you know, a little corner of your shirt works, all kinds of things can work. A towel from the guy's bathroom, because, you know, you're, you're in his bathroom probably. Anyway, and an another option it says here is any lightweight oil you can find. Time to break into the kitchen pantry. They're very sassy at InStyle.com, aren't they? Close eyes and smooth some EVOO. I believe that stands for extra virgin olive oil, even though we both know that you are not an extra virgin if you're in this guy's bathroom in the middle of the night. And even the darkest mascara will dissolve away. Good tip. The easiest way to remove a crease in your face from the pillow. Yeah, you don't want to leave the house with that going on. Um, it says here, splash warm water on your face and then massage in any moisturizer that you can find that's nearby uh, and fill in the crease. And even if you don't have moisturizer, just the circular motion of doing it brings all the blood back and sort of like, you know, is going to help smooth that out. You got to do that after any sort of massage or, any, you know, when your face is in the pillow. I hate walking through a spa after a massage knowing that that's going on on my face, but anyway. Very good tips from Inside.com on how to survive a Beauty 911 post-walk of shame.